Hey science lovers, it's Becky with Lab Rat Academy and I'm out here in my garden and my tomato vines have been falling off. This twine has been disintegrating in the weather because I live in salt weather. So um, these heavy tomato plants, check out how long these tomatoes are. All the way down, super heavy plant and they've been breaking off of these uh, twines. So I decided to go get something heavy duty to hold these up. And you can see that I'm gonna just start wrapping this wire down this vine like this and so that it keeps these tomatoes off the ground where the bugs are and the grubs and the raccoons and the possums and everything that wants to try to eat these. And I thought the vines are pretty fascinating because they have this end. The top of it is called a meristem. That's the top tipped part of your tomato plant. The meristem is the tip way up here. This can keep growing and growing and growing and growing. I can actually cut it right here and that would enable all the fruit. And that's actually what I'm going to do. I'm going to cut the, the meristem. That's the terminal bud off of the top. And that means that it's going to put all of its fuel into putting energy into filling up my tomatoes instead of making a longer plant. Also, the plant will decide, oh, I don't have a meristem terminal bud anymore. I'm going to put energy into making maybe a lateral bud. And you can see there's a lateral bud coming off right here. It's going to make another branch and try to make it longer because the terminal bud, the meristem on that one, was cut off. So I'm going to cut this one off too because it's going to be sneaky and try to go off that way. I just want to put energy into this because this is the tip of my rack and it's, it will sometimes make a huge arbor of vines, but this is all I need right now. I got lots of tomato plants. Let's just go ahead and focus on making these beautiful tomatoes luscious. And these are so beautiful. Delicious dinner. Hope you guys have a great day. We'll see you later. Bye-bye.